Hi, I'm Amber from Amber's Craft Week blog and welcome back to the Hey Day Challenge where we go through various pages of the book Hey Day and do activities relating to them. I apologize if my voice sounds a little weird, I'm just getting over a cold so please bear with me. For the April 11th entry, it's all about what's in your bag. Here is the deal. Find yourself stuck on the bus, waiting for the doctor, bored in study hall? No, it couldn't be true. We say dump it. Grab a pal, get your bag, and do the overturn. Your backpack or your purse, silly. You'll be amazed at all the stuff you got. So take stock, write it down, shove the list under your mattress, and if you find yourself unhappy with the contents of your bag, spend the night filling it up with cuter stuff. What do the contents of your bag say about you? Are you a neat freak or a slob? Do you have sticky, gooey candies in the bottom like Kia? Or open eye shout out in your bag like Cuba? Baby blue glitter everywhere. Are you a simple chick, just the essentials, or a pack rat, collecting everything but the kitchen sink in your bag? Um, Kiva and Clea. Compare your list with your friends' lists and declare someone the big booty bag queen. She'd be the one with the most stuff. For today's video, we're going to be going through my bag and seeing what's in there. Here is the bag that I carry with me daily. I also have another bag, which I keep my lesson planner in, but that one just has my lesson planner and some scrap paper and stuff like that, so I figured this would be the more interesting one to go through. Now I did put my phone in my bag before doing this video because I usually have my phone in if I'm traveling, but otherwise I have not changed the contents in any way. So let's see what's inside. Okay, first as I mentioned we have my phone. Next we have some earmuffs. So my ears get really cold in the winter, even in the spring, like anytime the weather's below 65, 70 degrees, my ears are going to get cold. So I have little ear warmers that I carry with me. And I'm actually filming this video in February, so if it seems a little strange that I have these in April, I might still have them there in April, but um, it's also still really cold out. Uh, tissues. Lots of tissues, because it is cold and flu season. Another wad of tissues. As I said, I'm just getting over a cold, so I decided that, you know, packing all the tissues I own was, would probably be, you know, the way to go. A pencil. Some hand sanitizer. My wallet, which has nothing super exciting in there, just like a Dunkin' Donuts gift card, uh, health insurance information. Usually I'll have Joanne gift cards in here, but I spent all mine. Uh, an Irving gift card, and then my old AC Moore card. So that's my wallet. An index card from my counselor. My keychain, which has basically all the keys that I have ever owned. I have keys to my parents' house, which comes in use sometimes, but also my parents' mailbox, one of these keys, is, I think. I have keys to my old office in Neville, Brian's old office in Neville, my current office, well, lab in uh, Bennett, uh, a bunch of the different doors in Bennett and so yeah lots of keys and then some really old cards I have uh, an old Rite Aid wellness card my old Bangor Public Library library card uh, a, a Best Buy reward zone card a Borders rewards card I never take things off this keychain as you can tell another one for Borders and then an AC Moore rewards card so and a keychain for my grandma. So yeah, that is my keychain. A pad. Another index card from my therapist. Another tissue. My headphones. A 
A couple more pencils. Another tissue. An empty tissue pack. I was trying to keep packs of tissues in my bag, but I ended up going through these too quickly because they have like three tissues in them. So I started just stuffing random tissues in there. My C-bands to help with my motion sickness. That feels like one more tissue. I had a pen in my bag, but it looks like I no longer have that. A fortune cookie fortune that says explore your own world by working together with your friends. And I think that's it. So if you ever were wondering what I carry around in my bag, that's the entire contents right there. What do you carry around in your bag? Anything surprising? Anything you'd forgotten about? Let me know in the comments. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, I'd love it if you gave it a like. If you want to see more videos in the Heyday series, then you may want to subscribe. If you like crafts in general, then check out my craft blog, amherstcraftweek.blogspot.com. Thanks for watching and have a great day!